And we have breaking news just into our newsroom this evening. Leaders with Austin's police union say they are not going to return to the negotiating table to agree on a new contract with the city. That decision comes after city council decided to shoot down a four year contract that had already been agreed upon in principle, instead opting to restart negotiations on a one year contract extension. Some council members said they want to wait to approve a longer deal until after Austinites get a chance to weigh in on a police oversight measure that's on the May ballot this year. Police leaders have said not having a new four year deal could lead to more officer resignations and officer retirements. After the council shot down the four year agreement, council member McKenzie Kelly told us this shows a lack of support for officers. I'm excited and thankful that voices will be heard from the community. Uh, but I also know it's important to do right by our officers, and I believe we can do that. And that was Zoe Kadri speaking, one of the other city council members. And Austin's new interim city manager, Jesus Garza, has been tasked with renegotiating this one-year deal. But with this statement from the police union, that task will seemingly be a lot harder. The current Austin police union contract expires on May 31st. We'll be right back after this break.